Welcome Virgo to Petrella's Intuitive Insights. This is a brief overview of June 1st to the 15th of 2022. As I was getting into the energy of the Virgo, <clears throat> self-respect and you know what's best for you. Many of you, uh, you listen to friends, relatives, uh, some, you know, you, you, you know what's best for you. So if you've been putting off, um, doing something that the Virgo has been wanting to do to better your health, to better your uh, thinking. Maybe some of you, it's going back to school. For some of you, maybe it's seeing that professional. Go get that doctor. Uh, go get that massage therapy. For some of you, it's actually wanting this relationship and solidifying a career, a new career. Well, now's that time. Uh, to bring it hand in hand, Virgo. <clears throat> it's with intentionality. So what you think about, you bring about, Virgo. So you need to continue with that as your uh, a resting and a renewal time. This is June 1st to the 15th of 2022. And we're going to ask, what does the divine have in store for you? Oh, I, I didn't even get to start. Uh, and these cards flipped out. I was going to go with love, romance, and relationship. Look at this. Look at this. This is uh, have to do with money and work. So for some of you, you're going to be uh, making the money and doing what you love to do. Now, for it's a mystery. There's something you're really unaware of, Virgo. It's going to be interesting to see how that pans out. And it's all in your favor. Oh boy, this is interesting. Virgo, look, the moon and the pasture with the shepherd indicates intense love of life. You're in a really good space during this time, Virgo. Your mind's in a good space. Your heart's in a good space. Intentionality, that is the time to manifest is when your heart and mind is in a good space. Here's the new residence. So, um, for some of you, Virgo, you may say, Petrella, you've been saying about this new residence for a long time now. Well, some of you, maybe you moved twice. Maybe somebody moved in and then moved out. Uh, maybe you're, you know, you've changed your residence in some manner. This is a very fortunate and lucky time for you, Virgo. Oh, wow. Okay, so somebody's been really keeping an eye on you. There may be some uh, eye awakening news going on here for you, Virgo. It, it may include some disappointment, but it's something you've never have, you've been disappointed before. But it really goes in your favor, Virgo, because here's the good luck and the success card that uh, you know, came out together. You know, Virgo, I, um, I was, uh, gifted a deck of cards from, um, a beautiful young lady. Uh, and so I would like their sacred destiny. Virgo. So I'm going to go ahead and, and pull a card from one of, uh, from this deck, this beautiful young lady, her name's Sam Dooney. So thank you. Okay. So Virgo, Virgo, what do the Virgo need to know as they're listening to this video, June 1st to the 15th of 2022, what does the divine have in store for you? This flipped out in a deck. The Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Fortune. Luck and right timing. It's as if, uh, you know, see, I can hear my wind chimes. I don't know if you can outside. Just gently blowing, gentle, gentle. So it's not like a major wind of change, but you're making it change, Virgo, in a good way, yes. And here's the magician's sword, which is confidence in your mag magic. The movement towards change and adventure. 
And look at this Virgo. Sorry about that. Here is reconciliations. Reconciliations. I'm sorry, but I'm not gonna just, you know, delete this whole video over that. And for some of you, I gotta tell you, Virgo, I think these reconciliations, they have to do more with um, you reconciling with yourself and who you are. Mm -hmm. Reconciling with the divine, increasing your prayers, being your sacred destiny, being who you are in a good way. Love, hollow bone teachability. I also got this with um, one of the other signs I just did. I believe it was Pisces. So if you look at the four feathers, there's one that's really different. They're all different, but the one really stands out. I really feel for many of you Virgo, you need to be that sacred one that stands out. Protecting the future. Uh, and I do believe that this has to do with, and it's the dragon's hoard. I mean, really look, it's a beautiful photo, beautiful picture. Look, Virgo, I really feel that you're looking for the future. This is where that self-respect comes in at. You know what you need to do and what's good for you. Whether this is in career and finance or taking care of your physical uh, body, your physical body. Um, I feel that this is going to be a balancing act during this particular time. And, <clears throat> and you need to rise above the chaos. And you could do this with prayer and meditation. Virgo, if this resonated with you and you like an, uh, further this reading, patrellasintuitiveinsights.com. It's listed in the link below for others of you. Um, I just, you know... If you'd like to help my channel to continue to go and grow, uh, it's it's fast and free. Just hit the like, share, subscribe button. And with that, thank you very much, Virgo, and God bless you.